Behind the scenes at the Natural History Museum is one of the most secure rooms in the nation. This vault contains gems and minerals worth untold millions, and among the treasures are some of the rarest stones of all, pink diamonds. These rough diamonds come from the Argyle mine in Western Australia, and scientists hope they'll solve the mystery of why pink diamonds are pink. As scientists, I can tell you why yellow diamond is yellow. It's a little bit of nitrogen in the diamond. I can tell you why a blue diamond is blue. It's a little bit of boron in the diamond. Um, I can't tell you why a pink diamond is pink. And it's a little bit exasperating when the highest price per carat gemstones in the world are being sold, and everybody's talking about them, and everybody loves them, and yet you can't tell people why they're pink. Scientists think the color may be caused by molecular changes, the result of a seismic shock billions of years ago when the stones were being formed. But first, they have to rule out the presence of any impurities. These are three argyle diamonds from the north of Western Australia. And we're going to put them in this highly uh, accurate mass spectrometer, which we'll be using to look for trace impurities uh, embedded within the surface. This machine agitates the diamonds and captures the atoms that are released. It happens in a vacuum to make sure there's no contamination from particles in the air. We're looking for anything we can find that's not carbon, whether that is a metal or a non-metal, uh, something that could be contributing to forming this coloration in these diamonds. The trouble is, scientists haven't found any impurities, which adds to the mystery of pink diamonds. So this is another pink diamond that's here on loan for us to do study on. This diamond is worth about $33 million, but scientists would much rather know where it comes from. In scientific terms, though, these smaller ones are actually more important than this big pink one, even though it's worth millions. Ironically, that's true, because the key is we know where these diamonds came from. They came from the Argyle mine in Australia. The large pink faceted stone, we have no idea what its origins are. And so as a scientist trying to study the geology or learn about the history of these diamonds, I need to know where they came from. So yeah, scientifically, very valuable. Scientifically, much less so. I still want to hold it, though. Oh, I understand that. <laughs> Scientists are pretty certain the pink is caused by a molecular defect. They just need to find it. But for many people, diamonds will never be anything less than perfect. Jane O'Brien, BBC News, Washington.